Yo, what's up, guys? Yo, sorry about that. Fucking, I had to fucking, oh, man. I had to try to, I tried, I tried to change some settings on here, so hopefully it works a little bit better. Um, and then we went to Best Buy and bought this fucking long-ass cable, so I don't have to wear the backpack in the front with the short cable, but then for some reason, this cable is not charging my phone fast enough, and my phone's fucking dying when I have this plugged in, so uh, the long cable's useless for now, but whatever, it's fine. Um, I turned off the XP fucking spamming in the chat, so um, hopefully that stops so much uh, XP spamming with people just spamming the chat, but we'll see. Um, and if I didn't, then I put a bot in the chat that makes it so you can't repeat your last phrase. Okay, well then, if you can get still get XP, well then I made a bot in the chat that makes it so you can't repeat your last phrase, because uh, then uh, there's no way to turn off the chat XP for people spamming the chat, so just don't fucking spam the chat. There's other ways to get XP, like uh, stickers and things like that. But, yo, Joey, if you want to turn off that fucking coffee mug, that would be great. Just, <laughs> Start off the coffee mug, make a, a sticker that's higher so people are not going to be using the coffee as much because that thing is getting ridiculous there with the, the amount of times I've seen it in the goddamn chat. So, oh man. All right, so we're here with EBZ. EBZ wanted to stop and get food, so we're going to go inside here, get some food with them. Or EBZ, he's got two stream snipers with them, so we're going to go sit at the table and uh, see what's going on with that. Dude, fuck that coffee mug, dude, honestly. And yeah, hopefully the, uh, the bit rate stays good and doesn't get like uh, fucking dog shit. So we'll see. Fucking he's, he's always eating. No, it's fine. I wanted to go to the Galleria and eat later, but he wanted to eat right now. So and he's driving, so it's like, all right. I mean, he's he's the driver, so let's do it. And there he is. Alrighty. What are you doing? Oh, okay. Let's find where the table is with these uh, two stream snipers. Do you have the key? Yeah, I got the key. Where's the You start ordering over there. The first red shirt you see your light is. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll sit down. And let me just go order some food. All right, let's see what we got here. Dude, this is... It's like a Chipotle barbecue place. Honestly, dude. What the fuck? All right. How you doing? Can I, uh, can I order here? Mm -hmm. Here go. Right here. For here? Oh, I have to... Oh, it's like a fucking... It's like Golden Corral, dude. I have to grab a... Like a tray, dude. Okay, hold on. How do I do that? Grab this here. I'm not really that hungry, to be honest. We ate breakfast before we started the stream, which was like three hours ago, so I'm not really that hungry. But I'll just get like something, just so I'm not sitting at the table not eating while everyone else is eating. I'm just gonna get a bunch of beans, probably. The bot doesn't work. Well, then, unfortunate. Then I don't know how to stop the, the I don't know how to stop the spam. We can make the slow mode a little bit higher, but it's a bunch of people doing it. It's not one person, so the slow mode doesn't really help with that. But I'll figure out a way. I, I, me and my mods are talking about it for all this time I was offline. We'll figure something out. We'll make our own bot if we have to. We'll figure it out. Fuck, fuck all the spam. Like, don't spam so much in the chat, please. Meaningful conversation, not random CX spam for no reason. Yo, can I just get a bunch of beans? Uh, can I just get beans? Yeah. Yeah, just like, you know, two bowls of beans. Or like a big, a bit, just a big bowl of beans. That's all I'm eating, so. Yeah, I'm gonna get that size right there. Yeah, just, uh, that's all I'm eating, so. Yeah, I already ate three hours ago. But I'm here uh, with a friend of mine, so I'm just gonna get a bowl of beans. <laughs> really? So you're, you're you're just coming to the line just yeah, to serve? Hey, I appreciate what you name, Isaac. I appreciate you, bro. Yeah, I'll be sitting over there. All good, homie. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. Yeah, don't worry about the uh, the motherfucking spam. It's whatever. It's, it's fine. 
I'll figure it out another time. <laughs> big, that's all. Big bowl, bro. Look at that. Mm. Mm. Easy. I don't really want barbecue. I'm not that hungry, so to be fucking honest with you, all I need is a side of beans. All right. Let's see. Go join them over there. See what they got. Yeah, Joe, if you're watching, can you uh, turn the coffee off, please? The coffee sticker, just, just turn it off. Going vegan? No, not going vegan. It's just, uh, I'm not that hungry. I'm only going to eat probably half this bowl, so. Yeah, I'm going to say something to you. You think Yuzi's going to say something about me just getting a bowl of beans? We'll see. What's he gonna say? How you doing? Six forty four. They gonna say about your beans? Yeah, just that. Okay, six forty four. Six dollars for a bowl of beans? Uh huh. Wow. Big bowl. Oh wow. <laughs> how much? Yeah, bowl it wouldn't be. How much? How, how much are the ribs? The ribs? Three seventy nine a rib. Want one rib? How big is the rib? Is it like a big rib? Four rib. The rib is cheaper than the beans. Yeah. Wow. And I don't want a rib. Wow, that's ridiculous. Yeah, no, that's fine though. Nothing like a big bowl of beans. I mean, a lot of protein, carbs, fats, everything you need. Meat only has meat doesn't have it only has protein. It has carbs. And then also meat, you know, if there's no carbs, how do you stay energized? Where do I get the utensils? Oh, thank you. She did not want to talk to me. <laughs> Fuck it. So the stream sniper said that Houston is fucking has nothing to do and it's trash. Well, not, not trash. They said there's nothing to do here. We'll see. Let's uh, we'll talk to him when we get to the table. Yo, what's up, guys? <laughs> what do you guys? Yeah. Oh, that's so. One of those ribs, is three dollars. That's crazy. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. Wait, I'll take your phone, please. Yeah, I'll take it. Thank you. Yeah, let's do it. How's uh, how's Houston? It's good. You like it? They said they don't like it. No, no, we do like it. It's chill. It's chill. It's chill. Uh, the weather, you don't like the weather? There's just no nightlife. Yeah, no nightlife. No nightlife? No nightlife? I thought, was, I thought somebody told me this was only nightlife. No, there's no nightlife. No daylight, no nightlife. What is this? Daylight is food. Yeah. Oh, great. You go to Houston to visit food places. Hope you enjoy your food. The, the, the perfect place. Yeah. So we go to Houston to eat food. To try out food, yeah. Damn, this is not the place for me. Houston, I don't eat Houston, food for shit. Houston is a, is, a, is a place to eat food. It's not so... No I do not eat fucking food. Like, not, I don't eat that much food. You're not going to finish today. I'm not. probably going to eat half of that. Yeah, you're only going to take three spoonfuls and that's it. Well, let's, I mean, probably. They're pretty filling. But let's see. What'd you get? A pork pork sandwich. Chopped beef. Good shit. These beans aren't that good. And they're spicy. Yeah. Texas uh, chili is going to have a bit of spice. Mm -hmm. That's chili. It's all right. How are the ribs? Really good. good. That's really good. good. You want to try it? Uh, yeah, I'll try uh, just, just, a, just a bite. The, the bark is for all the flavors there. The what? The bark is for all the flavors there. I mean, the bark. What do you call the bark? The outer layer. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh it's called bark? Yeah. I don't think that's very good meat. I don't think that's very good barbecue. I don't know. Austin's got some good barbecue, so I, I don't think that's uh, that great. Yeah, Austin has some good shit, too. Yeah, there's a pussy bite. I'm not trying to eat fucking ribs. I'm not that hungry. I just want some beans. We already ate. We ate Church's chicken before we started the stream. We already had a bunch of chicken. chicken is good, too, yeah. Have you had a barbecue? 
Oh, yeah, Whataburger is shit. Whataburger is so bad. Do you have Whataburger, right? Dude, it's... I like it better than the in and out no, you know. Yeah. How do you like that better than in and out yeah. You gotta be. Well, you gotta be raised on water. Bro. I thought maybe it's like it's served like, with water, and chuck some water in the burger. Nah, it's yeah. some good shit. It's filling. Yeah, yeah, you, you, have, to, you have to try it before you leave. What's different about a water? Burger? I mean, I think it's kind of like Burger King, but like shittier. It's like big burgers and stuff. Yeah, but, the burgers are burgers. But the uh, I don't know. It's like a I shitty Burger King. <laughs> I've got a lot of leftovers that's in my room to get shitty burgers. I got full, you know, full something. Well, you uh, you should try it before you leave. Let everyone okay. know what you think. It's open 24 hours. 24 hours, yeah. All day. How much is that again? Some of the old? Uh, yeah, it was $6. Why? I always feel bad for anyone to work for the bill. It's $17. Uh, but I mean, that's a good deal, folks. Yeah, what do you mean? That's normal. No, we crossed the same bridge, except I spent a lot of money crossing that bridge. You were able to cross that bridge just hungry. We were both hungry. You crossed $100, maybe $6. You crossed $17. Like, I'm not $100. I mean, that's why I'm 160 pounds, though. Because I don't fucking eat that much. I got to. I got to. I don't know. You don't want to be skinny. Even the, chick, the chicken is not. Done. Yeah, the you chicken. Want to try it? No, no, I already tried it. I always, I always get them when they come. Yeah, do I have any pods in chat here? No, no, that's all you, dude. That's all you. Nah, I'm full, dude. Yeah. Yeah. 160 in need. So what, uh, what do you guys recommend that we do? Today? Huh? What do you recommend that we do here today? I want to go to an open mic. Like, I want to go to a place that has karaoke instrumentals like a drum on my recent records. Mexican places are good for that. Mm-hmm. Straight up. <laughs> Straight up. It sounded very funny when you said it. Mexican places are good for that. But let's do it. That's a good stop. Open mic night. Where, where is, what do you, where would you be willing to sing though? Because you weren't singing at the bar so, last night. Let me say it again. I want to find a karaoke that has instrumentals where I can perform one of my latest records. <laughs> You could have you could have performed it yesterday if you would have asked him. Yeah, you gotta ask him. I did ask him. You heard what I said. What they don't have said? instrumentals. Huh? They didn't have instrumentals. Well, well I don't know if you're gonna find a bar. Which one do you want to perform? Friends? Which one do you want to perform? Friends? I'll catch the vibe. When I see what instrumentals they have and I see the vibe, you don't just perform any song anyway, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll catch the vibe and I see what song they have. Oh, so it's, something, so it's like a freestyle. I don't think you're going to be able to find a bar that has open mic like that. Not today. I, I think you're being pessimistic. Let's be optimistic. Not today. Mm-hmm. These guys I mean, just gotta, <laughs> these guys double down know. like not today. Most of, most of the time it's just karaoke. Or you can just like finesse your way into singing your own song. What did you, did you see the whole that way too. thing with, this, with the girl he was talking to for four years? What do you think? I did. Of, what do you think about it? I mean, if you're talking to a girl online for four years and you haven't met yet, yeah. it's a red flag. <laughs> how do you how do you not meet her? She, yeah, she shit herself. Hey, she came with her husband. Huh? Yeah, with her husband. Yeah, yeah, with her boyfriend. Yeah, or husband. Or I mean, somebody shitting themselves ain't that bad. I've shit, I've shit myself. Yeah, I've shit myself. Too. I mean, it just happens, you know? Yeah. I was laying on the floor in the bathroom and I thought it was as far as the shit. I was like, <laughs> went on the fucking rug, dude. Yeah. I don't know, the only shit I think about is that sports I mean, that's good. <laughs> well, we should we should walk around the uh, EBZ. Well, we should walk around the actual like city before we go into a sports bar. I want to go check out the Washington Street. Washington Avenue? Yeah. Yeah, we can go there, dude. It's... Montrose is better right now. Well, let's Montrose go there, then. Yeah. What's the difference? It's a gay area. It's a gay. gay district. I mean, that's fine. I mean, that's, I mean, whatever. Yeah, yeah, like, fuck it. I mean, as long, <laughs> as long as they got people and shit, that's fine. He doesn't like gay districts. Why are we going to a gay district? It's the big ass Houston. You want to go to a gay district? That's what's popping now. That's what's, I mean, if it's popping, I mean, if it makes something it else is going to be popping later. If it, may, if it makes it feel comfortable. There's a, lot, there's a lot of girls there. Good looking bitches. Good looking. That's where you find all the girls out there. But they're going to think he's gay. No, no, no. 
I mean, there's they, Yeah, they can tell. There's they can tell. How can you tell he's gay or not? What about me? <laughs> Once I get back to LA, so, so what's the, the what's the gay district in LA? Leaves me alone. What would what would you consider? It's uh, gay? West Hollywood. West Hollywood. Yeah, tons. Everyone there is gay. gay everyone in LA is gay, to be fair. But when you bring when you bring Gary out to Oz to Texas, I don't know. I mean, no plans to currently. Mm. Well, you're maybe you, the maybe, trip. maybe Europe, but that's about it. Yeah. That's not till next month, though. Where are you going? I mean, I want to go to all the, like, Eastern, or no, Western, Western European Can I meet up with Trixel? countries. Uh, I mean, he's in England. I don't think I'm going to England. Because yeah. so, it's kind of, like, away from everything else. But we'll see. Just the audience sent you something for open mic room. One more in the day, they walked around shops down the mall. Montreal's only town is where you need to go for walking. Okay. They won't do a fuck. For what? About the TCS? Well, I mean, it depends. Yeah, 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 as far as okay. IRL around here, there's nothing right now, dude. Around this area, nothing. I mean, we could just hang out. We could just, we'll just chill. Me and EBZ will just be chilling, like, whatever. Like, we'll just yeah, hang yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not really a big deal. You told us where to go. We'll go there. We'll check it out. Oh, you got to tell us specifically what y'all trying to do. I mean, I'm trying to go to a place that has a bunch of people. So we can, like, talk with them and hang out. Maybe get some drinks. Things like that. Damn, though. Yeah. What's that about? Um, I, so about that. I mean, if you say that's the gay district, then. The mantra, yeah, we can go so there. be it. So be it. Let's go. As long as you don't get uh, our ass grabbed. Well, I mean, yeah, I don't mind, won. but. We won. Yeah, yeah. One minute before we go. Alright. Well, let's yeah. do it then. Yo, do I really have no mods in this chat right now? Yeah. Fucking... Fuck, get rid of the ASCII. That shit is AIDS. What's up? <laughs> PBC's going to the gay district, I don't care what he says, we're going there. We're, going, we're definitely going, I mean he's driving, but we're definitely getting him convinced him to go there. You look shorter on screen, bro. Shorter on stream? Oh, yeah, they look shorter. <laughs> I mean, I guess they don't get the full perspective on camera. <laughs> How tall did you think I was? At least. Well, you said you were 6'3. I said 6'2, yeah. 6'2. I mean, you look tall in person, but on stream. Well, how tall are you? I'm 5'11. Gotcha. See, Gary, I'm not 5'11". <laughs> yeah, I'm 5'11". Tell that EBC guy, Klaus says hi, bro. All right, I got you, bro. Thank you, dog. Appreciate it, homie. EBC, you know... Is it the thing that's flashing? Okay. EBC, Klaus says hi. Klaus 10. You know Klaus 10? The guy who draws everybody? Yeah. What up, man? What up, what up? He said he wanted to do some shit with you. Sexually. Alright. Let's go over to uh, to that place. I don't even find it funny. Just like when it comes in my direction, it just means somebody's insulting me. I don't, don't put that camera to me, honestly. Like, I don't find it funny. You just let some idiot use you. To insult, don't do that. Do you think that is insulting? Do you think it is insulting? I don't want to debate it. You should know I don't like it, and so do not do it. No, he didn't say that. I just made it up. You should make things like that up. You should know I don't like it. It's like when you tell me things you don't like, I just take it for that. I just say okay. I don't start trying to debate you and reason you why you should start liking it. Like it's 
some gay ass shit. You should ditch your girlfriend and get a boyfriend if you want to engage into those kind of conversations. Yeah, I've, I've had a boyfriend. What do you mean? Good. And keep it like that. But what, I, what's wrong, I don't what's find wrong it entertaining. with it? I don't find it entertaining. So you could talk about it when it comes to you and I would not challenge it. But does I tell you I don't want it coming in my direction? Do not challenge that. I do not find it funny. I mean, it's an insult to the person. I just told you I'm not gay and I don't find it funny. I don't even like hearing that crap. It's very, it's an insult. Like, who the fuck goes around talking about dicks with a car full of guys? <laughs> you're weirdo, Paul. Like, that's, it's getting frustrating, like, for Christ's sake. A car full of guys and you're talking about dicks. Like, come on, man. Just deal with that. I mean, are you, like, in the closet or something? Whatever the fuck it is, I don't want to talk about guys and gays and dicks when I'm in the car, all right? I'll... Well, you do know they <laughs> said the place to go is the gay district. Paul, I hope you get my drift. Oh, I, I mean, I get your drift, but I'm just telling That's you, I'm they saying, said man. the place to go is the gay district. That's all I'm saying, because this gay talk, I mean, you don't like being, you don't like slander, right? You don't like people insulting you in your stream and shit like that? Well, I'm not slandering you, I'm just trolling you. They're not trolling me, you're disrespecting me, and I'm telling you to stop it. Okay. If I, just, if I tell somebody I don't like something and they continuously do it, that's an insult, right? Because you just know I don't like it. That's like me letting lousy TTS blare when I know it's, dis it's dis disturbing you, right? But you do let it blare. No, I don't. No, I don't. What are you going to say? You're going to tell me that I'd rather piss you off? Is that what you're trying to in imply? No, that's not what I'm implying. Okay, then. I'm implying that you're rathering to piss me off, like you'd rather piss me off right now. I just don't know what pisses you off about it. I'm not saying you're gay. I'm saying this guy wanted to do something gay. He says, I'm sorry, EBZ. I will no, miss... Don't read me that message. Don't read that message to me. It's a nice one. Where are my fucking keys? We're changing the atmosphere. You notice how fast you change it? That gay talk is not funny. I don't find it funny. We just went from having a pleasant evening to some crap. I mean, I, I thought it was funny. I don't know. Like, where are my keys? You, you have the me? keys. You have the keys, Paul. No, I gave you the keys. You're probably in your bag. I'm I don't understand these motherfuckers. Like, everywhere in the world I go, motherfuckers are lead that conversation when they're not gay. They just understand that it's a, it's a stupid conversation to engage in. And then you come on you're hanging around certain people who just don't see the taboo and the nonsense. Like, they're talking about ass and feces. What? Like, dicks and guys. Like, what the fuck is wrong with you guys? There's no taboo. There's no taboo in that. Every every city is, has a gay district. There's no taboo yeah, there. Yeah, leave the gays to do what gays do. Like, no one is talking about them. Let them live their lives wherever they live their lives. Okay? Period. <laughs> Where are my keys? I think he might be closeted. I don't know. I don't know. And if somebody said that somebody wanted to do gay stuff with me, I'm, I'm flattered. I wouldn't get annoyed by that. That's, in, that's what interesting. What are you vaping on? Uh, Jewel. It's just tobacco flavor. What, what flavor, though? Tobacco. It's tobacco flavor? They didn't have anything else at the store. So I just got the fucking tobacco flavor. Is it cheaper here than LA? Uh, I mean, it was like 15 bucks. It wasn't bad. How much is it over there? It so was... I mean, it was probably the same price, yeah. You should, you should definitely... <laughs> you don't know where it is. Right there. You should definitely get bold this in here. Oh, yeah. He's coming uh, <laughs> He's coming to Austin at the end of the month. So, he's definitely going to be getting some vapes. Yeah, tobacco flavor's not that good, but no, it like shit. it's just, you know, it's, it's all they have, so. It's better than the mango. I don't like the mango flavor. I thought it was fucking shit. If you guys are by Sharpstown Mall, run over there while there's still traffic. Oh, right the there. Mexican oh, yeah. guys should know where it's at Plaza yeah, America. Yeah, Plaza America. Yeah, that's what I was telling them. Plaza Americas, we won't get kicked out, bro. They won't give a fuck. What is that? It's a it's a scuffed ass mall. Scuffed counterfeit mom. shit. Good. <laughs> scuffed it's shit. Counterfeit shit. It's good. Yeah. It's good. I mean, let's, let's go over the there then. The thing they have there is like jewelry. Do they sell Rolexes? Yeah, yeah, they did. Jewelry. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. Timmy Jewelry used to be there. It's still there, but it's not ran by Johnny Dang. Well, let's go over there then.
How far is that? Uh, yeah, let's let's go check. Let's go get a Folex. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Whatever they got, I guarantee they don't have this row. Relax. Don't worry about it. Is Paul Wall still live in Houston? Yeah, he does. Yeah. I've seen him drive around uh, on North Street. Where does he live at? Oh, shit, I don't know. He probably lives in he used to do a lot of collabs with Chameleon Air. Yeah, so. yeah that's your favorite rapper. Well, he was when I was <laughs> when I was like 14. They were on the same label, so. When was the last time you did Lean? The last time I did Lean? Yeah. I've only done Lean once, what? and it was like a year and a half ago. I'm asking ice. That's a great donation you got there, dude. But I guess that's my karma for saying that gay shit. <laughs> for saying the gay shit. Yeah, you pissed up. <laughs> this is where I passed out. Uh, give me the directions. Right here. I'm gonna put it up. Left, right. Uh huh. Starting. Yo, Ebenezer, there is not a viewer on any stream that believe you're gay. Trust me, we all know you're straight as an arrow. Don't get so upset. I don't Just care about it. you we thinking I'm nice straight. Poseidon's repertoire to say gay shit to get I don't care about you thinking I'm straight or not. It just does yeah, something to my blood. I don't like talking that kind of shit. It's an insult to the person who is not it. Maybe my mind just wants to research much more than... I thought we was friends, man. When I play Zoe 101, you dance to it. All love, bro. No Zoe 101. No, no, please. It just smells like weed. Oh. Okay. Please don't burn the seats. Nah, dude, I'm good. Uh, rental, right? I don't think it's that big of a deal. When you, how you, when you grew up, was it like a taboo? Make a I just grew up to respect Blue people and not insult them, nor crack little sly jokes about them, even though I was not with them. Right? Want me to put that over there? Yeah, I just, yeah, I just yeah, don't know how to insult people, jeer at them, or laugh at them unnecessarily. So if somebody well, has, I would, would I would jump in front of a gay person who was gay in this situation because he was gay in a heartbeat. I would be his advocate in a heartbeat. But I also what he's doing in the, soldier, in the dark because it's a private conversation. Let him heel slap you back to chowder heads. I don't think EBZ would slap me, it's but It's a private you. conversation. <laughs> Just like I don't want to know what would you slap people me? are doing in, their, in the dark. No, I'll walk away from you, Ice. I'll walk away from you faster <laughs> <don't>, than I'll <laughs> slap you. I don't, yeah, I don't, think, I don't think he would slap me. EBZ slaps people that are extremely I disrespectful. Yeah, yeah. I don't think I'm that disrespectful. I mean, I, yeah, I joke around the gay stuff, but that's not... A disagreement is a disagreement. It doesn't warrant a fight. It's just a disagreement. I mean, if you look at all the time when I fought people, it was actually, it wasn't a disagreement. It was them saying, you ain't shit. And it's like, oh, in my face? Like, that's not a disagreement. That's you trying to see. That's a different story. That's it. He skips the gay song. <laughs> If the, if the screen goes off, you can just wipe it up. About it. I can cut the tension with a knife. This feels like a, uh, what do you call it? Orange County around the Disneyland? <laughs> They're working on the highways too. The building's Houston, Houston's definitely getting bigger. Are they just, they're building new things? Yeah, they're building yeah. new, they're getting new highway. highway. What are they building? I think it extends to San Antonio oh, and Austin. You, if, if you go down to K, they're, they're building a new, uh, new Chinatown in K. Oh yeah, the new Chinatown is popping actually. That's like a Sugar Land issue. Yeah, Sugar Land Katie. But, uh, yeah, there's a lot of shit opening up here now. Definitely Chinatown in Houston is good. Should we go to China? Like Asian food? China, China, Houston. Should we go to China? Yeah, 
we go to Chinatown? Well, let's go to Plaza Americas and then Chinatown because it's on the way there. Alright. It's yes. basically the same area. Well, they're both in the same area. So you said it's like a mall, but it's like a scuffed mall? Yeah, it's scuffed as fuck. They have a flea market inside. <laughs> they have a flea market inside. We like the... We like the Hispanic uh, little like chamoy shit. They have shit like that. What else do they have in Chinatown besides food? Asian too. Just a bunch of girls? Yeah. Why, why do girls go to Chinatown? Okay. We did say we were going to meet some people this evening. We're not going to ditch them. We're going to find a location and then try to meet up with them as well. Because they were going to take us around. So like we're ditching them. So that's not a ditch What's that? Remember the couple from like last night? Yeah, well, when are they supposed to come out?
All right, I just had to make, I just had a message real quick. Sorry about that shit. So how far away is this place? Eight minutes? All right. Mind you. seen fish a million times. I've been in so many aquariums. <laughs> a fish is a fish, you know? It's yeah. all the same thing. At least the stream's not lagging as much. The beaches are better in LA? Continue on US the beaches are good, yeah. More, Orange County has better beaches. The LA beaches aren't that great. But, um, the beaches and, uh, yeah, I don't know. Nothing really compares to Florida, though. Yeah. Like the water areas, Too much media going on, dude. Leave it on. You got too much. It you got too much media. You got fucking Don't donations fuck saying fucked up shit. Leave your shit on. some like uh, some mall it's like a scuffed mall that has like uh, I don't know like 
funny stuff, like counterfeit stuff. But I guess we'll see when we get there. Counterfeit stuff. Yeah, it's a whole ball. It's just knock-off <laughs> brand. Knock-off brand. That's all you're going to find. That's what's up. Custom made tees. That's where they go to get their custom made shirts, to be honest. Shit, I'm my favorite. I'm going to make some shirts myself. Custom made. I was gonna make a shirt with your face, my with the Discord face. Oh, for real? <laughs> That's yeah. crazy. I'm sure it can work some shit out. That's just, uh... In a quarter mile. That shit's funny when you make a uh, when you when, when, when you got your little costume going on, when you put the wig on and shit. Yeah, that little costume, that yeah, little uh, shit. wig thing. <laughs> that shit's funny. I've been driving, <laughs> stare, stare, you know, staring, staying away from it to an extent, just because you know it's kind of like. Yeah, yeah, when yeah. When I see images of people, other people doing it, it's kind of like some clown shit. You know? It's fun while it lasts, but sometimes. Turn right, then turn left. It is what it is. If you're making a lot of money for doing it, it makes sense, but if not, it's kind of like some clown shit. But yeah, it's, it's, stuff. it's fun while it lasts. Yeah, Thank you, dude. Appreciate that, homie. That's pretty good. This used to be Sharp Summer. This is where all the ghetto people used to hang out with. Say that again? This is where all the ghetto people used to hang out at. Why this place? Just where they got all the. Oh, it's a cheaper mall. Yeah. Knockoffs. That's where they came to get their shoes and their custom made tees and all Yeah, right. The grills. And That's where we're at, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's why. That's where we're at. in Houston probably just today and I'll probably go back tomorrow to Austin so we'll see how that works yeah I'm a little annoyed at that yeah, fucking t at that media TTS but whatever what's that splitting up or oh let's just go inside here first and see what it is what you guys talking about what's that oh I thought I thought y'all were splitting up because I've got two screws going on two different screens going on what does that mean? Yeah, we, Damn. No, y'all wouldn't split, split <laughs> up. Yeah, no, man, it's, I mean, it's the same it. content it. to me. Right. <laughs> Listen, I, I mean, if I, wanna, if I don't want to be with you guys, I just would not be with you guys. Yeah, yeah, I'd be you. with you guys acting like I'm going to be over here. That's some weird ass <laughs> shit. I'd just be like, I'll see you later. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's see what's in this place. internet here. I mean, it's just like a big mall. I don't know about uh, counterfeit stuff, but we'll see. It definitely does look like a scuffed mall, but we'll see what's in here. I mean, I don't own any really knockoff items. Not really. If, I, if I'm going to buy something, I might as well buy the real thing. I used to listen to that before. That's a while back.
So where are the stores at? I can replace my Rolex. I don't want a Folex. <laughs> yeah, there's literally nobody in this mall. They do have this like a ghetto toy store over here. What the, what is this? Is it open right now? Huh? Is it open right now? Yeah, it's open. Toys. It's like a ghetto Toys R Us. Just, it's literally just backpacks. It's literally just a bunch of backpacks in there. There's some jewelry right here. Let's go upstairs and see the flea market. <laughs> so this is uh, this is what this is what's going on in Houston, huh? Malls. Is there a bunch of malls here in Houston? Uh, Galleria, this one, the Western Mall, and there's the Oaks Mall. Oh, you know, you know, that way. That way? Yeah, we can actually keep it. I need a fucking drink. <laughs> That's what I need. Fucking weird vibes. That's a in that car. Over there. What's that? Food court over there. So what's a what 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 makes this like a flea market? Oh you'll see it right here. You'll see. You gotta go inside the stores to check out the brands. Cause now you're not gonna know if it's kind of fit. Sorry? No? Oh, no videoing here? Just, just put it down. Just put it down. Just put it down for now. Well, I mean... It yeah, I'm not, I don't want to sit here and avoid security all day. Oh, like, I'll just wish you could go somewhere else. We can't record here. All right. Although she did not tell EBC. Huh? She, didn't yeah, say, she, didn't she, she didn't say anything to him. It's up. Here, hold on. I, I'm just going to leave them all. She's going to, she's like, they're, they do not want us to record in here, so we should just go. It's gonna be the same way in Galleria, dude. Well, then we should stick to uh, we should just go to Washington or that other Washington or Avenue? the other the other place. All right, cool. Uh, all right, Montrose. Yeah. Okay. Outside top shit. There's a opposite, there's outside malls. It's called the City Center. Or if you want to go down towards downtown towards the uh, Discovery Green, it's a park. Like a normal park. Huh? Like just a normal park? Uh, yeah, it's just the main park here. It's Discovery Green. It's by the convention center. Yeah, let's just go to Washington. All right, cool. Let's go. Let's just see what's going on over there. 
big seats. Yeah, I'm telling you, it's because they ain't got counterfeit shit here with that shit. So you haven't been to Lake Travis in Austin? <laughs> uh, no, I haven't. No, you should go, dude. Yeah, here's just a big lake. Get a boat, be nice. Yeah. You've never been to San Antonio either. No, I haven't. You should go. Is it nice there? Yeah. I know they have the Alamo, but that's uh, I don't it's, know what else is going on. I say it's better. I say it's better. Oh, hey Stevie. What's up, bro? Where are you at? It's here. <laughs> what are you doing? Good to see you, bro. Up, nice to see you, dog. This shit. Bro, <laughs> you always say come to Houston. Yeah, There's nothing going on in Houston. What do you mean, with nothing going on? Oh, the fuck is going on in Houston? Yeah. Dude, you know what's a lot of going on? Let's go to fucking Third Ward. What is that? <laughs> Third Ward is the ghetto. We're, no. Yeah. No, why, why, what are we going to do there? We're going to get pressed. Dude, let's just let's just go to Amaranth's house. <laughs> I mean, let's go to A. Let's go to Memorial. That's, that's way better over there. Memorial City. What's uh, we don't want to go to Galleria. What's uh, over there? Huh? What's uh, Memorial City? It's another like, it's just like Galleria, except like, because um, there's more shit to do in Galleria. You can walk around, there's like, there's like this park, and then like, uh, there's like all these nice places there. It's a lot nicer. I was but, just going like, to go to Washington. Huh? I was just going to go to Washington Avenue. Oh. Is that decent? Fuck it, yeah. Is that good? I mean, it's just to, it's just to see like the fucking like a statue, and that's pretty much it. There's no like bars of people and stuff. Yeah, like. around. There's always bars everywhere, like little things to go fucking sit down and drink. Well, people were just suggesting we go there, so. Yeah, we go to Washington. Yeah, yeah we should just go there. We go to the aquarium. Um, you ever want to space in in Houston? <laughs> Yeah, where, where is the Space Center? Like the NASA? Space Center in Houston. It's like a, like, like a 40, 40 minute drive. Is that really where it's just like it's a museum? Pretty, it's fucking badass. It's like they a have a museum and it's like a, like an attract, uh, like the guy. Gotcha. <clears throat> I mean, probably we, not going to. We can rock around the gallery. There's a lot of cool shit there. Well, like, we're probably not going to be able the mall because the mall is probably, like the main thing there. We're probably like, not going to be able to record there, though. It's around the huh? We're probably not going to be able to record inside of there. Yeah, you can. Well, we can't record here at the Scuff Mall. So how are we going to record at the nice one? Who says you can't? The security working here. He just told you that? Yeah, he said no recording. Tell him to suck your dick. <laughs> <laughs> can't say that. <laughs> that would uh, like that's just going to cause problems. Ah, sure, yeah. So I think we should just stick to like streets, like outside, things it's like that. It's, it's too fucking hot for that shit. <laughs> so everywhere's inside. It has to be indoor, man. Yeah, I mean, it's not that hot right now. It's like 90. Earlier it was 100. 90. <laughs> Earlier it was 100, so. What happened with you? Oh. Well, they're, they're catching up. <laughs> I just, I, I'm just too afraid to be around his TTS. It's, it's fucking, fucking, it it's fucking annoying me. How you been, dude? Good, you know, just uh, going for work, doing all that shit. Fucking tired as hell. Then I was fucking trying to find you. That's the way. <laughs> I was trying to find you, and I'm like, dude, how the fuck does these stream snipers do it to find you? Yeah, I, I'm I like, didn't, what the fuck? I didn't I'm like know. literally messaging you, and I still don't know where the fuck you are. I didn't know where the fuck we were, dude. Some barbecue place. <laughs> I, I didn't know where the fuck we were, we were at, dude. Honestly, bro. At least I managed to find EBZ. Towel inside. <laughs> so you drove in here, you saw the towel, and you came inside. Yeah. Gotcha. No, plus I knew I knew what, what Ma got talking about. This used to be called Sharpstown, and then like uh, the Mexicans took over and they just changed it to Plaza America. Gotcha. So that's why he said this is just like. Uh, it, it used to not be ghetto. Ah. Uh, At some point, well, it's always been ghetto. What's up, dude? What's up, bro? What's How you doing? Hey, what's, up, what's your name? What's up? Uh, Yo, nice to see you, bro. Yeah. Uh, uh, I think we're... Some coochie? Some coochie? Yeah. What is that? Fake coochie. 
No, we were just checking this place out, but they, they told us to leave. Oh, wow. The camera. We were, yeah, camera. So we were, we were going to go to Washington. What's that? I got, I'm going to pitch you this idea. What's that? What if, what if you tell ABZ that I know where you can get a lot of girls, but take you guys on to somewhere that's, you know, a little homosexual? That kind of area. How do you feel about that? I think that's a good idea. You think so? Yeah, I think it's, I think that is a good idea, but I, is there shit to do there? Yeah, there's a lot of shit to do. Yeah, you, you do a lot. Drink, party. Is well, it, let's go. Is it right now? Well, I mean, right. how else would we do it? Uh, what? Oh, wait, what's going on? She's busy. Okay. Hey, let's just, let's just go somewhere else. When we're outside. We're outside. I don't know why she's following us with, that was so fast. with the stream on the camera on her phone, but okay. God, dude. You see that fucking lights on? This is awful. We're, we are walking away from the mall because the parking lot is still the no filming area, I guess. She's so mad though. That's a that's a Houston ghetto security guard right there, dude. So how how else do we do it? Uh, we can't go right now because it's too early. It's too early right now. Well, then, mean, what would you suggest for right uh, now? You want to change? Sorry, I don't know if you want to get on the like that. I don't know if you have like a. Do you have like a Twitter? Easy. What's what's good? How are you doing? What's your name? It's, going, it's Jonas. 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 My friends. It's like Jonas, but with a, with a y, y instead. You should just go back to YouTube or only getting 1k viewers on Mixer. There is nothing else to test Paul. If you're not careful, you're gonna end up losing YouTube sponsors at a big. That's it's it's fine, dude. I'm just don't worry about it. Listen, that's not what I'm, I'm not worried about it. Don't worry about it. Hey, hey, why don't we just move over the party to the thrift center across the street? Yeah, let's just go across the street and we can talk about where to go. I have to. We're in the parking lot talking. Come on, now, unless you're just... We're in the parking lot talking like people. There's nothing wrong with being in the parking lot and talking to a friend. We're not running away from anything. Yeah, we can talk about the YouTube yeah, sponsors tripping. later, dude. Yeah. She was following them. Yeah, she was following them. I'm watching the street. And we got the security over here. Anyway, you know this guy? Who? The guy who just pulled up? Yeah, he said he's watching the stream. Alright, you want to follow him to the spot he's talking about? Where did he say he was uh, he didn't, go? He didn't say really anywhere to go. He said it's too early to do anything at the moment. That's what he was saying. Did you tell you were streaming? Yeah, we should just get out of the parking lot so there's no issues. Yeah. Let's drive out of here. Let's just drive to another parking lot. Just go across the street. Just, yeah, drive to another parking lot. Yeah, across the street, they won't care. Yeah. I, I mean, you, you also said that about this mall. No, no, yeah, boy, that's, that's what we thought. I've never, you know, I'm not a streamer. <laughs> Gosh, dude, that, that was fucking stressful. No, it wasn't. This basic bitch. But they would do the same together, really. Yep. Faster. Oh, we're just gonna go somewhere quiet. What is this bitch doing? Following me? Yeah, she's following me. I'm gonna ask her right now. Just, just keep driving. No, I mean, Who cares? Keep driving. Why do you gotta press security, dude? Why you gotta talk to the security? Are you following us? We're leaving the parking lot. Are you following us? Yeah, we're leaving though. We're leaving the parking lot. Okay. Yeah, we're already leaving. There's no need to stop and talk to her. Oh yeah, but I mean, she's just, she's just tripping. They, they, they don't do this shit on the regular, dude. 
They don't get all high up on their horses. Well, there's probably not many people walking around with selfie sticks in their mouths. I always give in to nonsense. You're funny because you stand up for dick talking, but actual, real, principle based situations, you want to cave in. Like, well, what are you going to do? Sense. You're going to argue with the no, security guard? No, you're going to argue with security, but she's pressing you about nonsense. Like, who gives a fuck if you have a selfie stick in your hand? Yeah, well... You don't even give a fuck if you have a selfie stick. If you really give a fuck, you would have held your selfie stick down when you walk into places, but you hold it up high, knowing exactly how you feel when they tell you about it. And then what, just hold the selfie stick down at all times? No, I'm saying saying that when they press you, you should actually have a reason for for holding your selfie stick high. I mean, were you holding it high to troll them? Because when I hold it high, it's not to troll them. It's because I'm recording. Okay, but okay. so let's say we walk in, selfie sticks down, and then we get inside. We keep it down at all times? You just be cautious as you do. Because every I don't when I walk into places, I don't you get can't just out. You can't just keep your shit down places, the whole time, dude. Check this out. When I go Yo, places, what are you streaming on? The quality is pretty good. Come and tell me. Also, what is going on? Hold on my phone. Sorry. Okay, no YouTube sponsor's going to stream on there anymore. Do you make... Okay. Um, I don't make any money on here currently, but... Yeah, the sponsors on YouTube have nothing to worry about, trust me. But, um... Yeah, dude, just why would... Like, they have the authority in their places. And I don't want to walk around with a selfie stick in my pocket the whole time. That What does that do? That's not a stream. Gotcha. I mean, don't you think so? When you hold the camera in your pocket the whole time when you're in the building, how is that a stream? At the end of the day, Paul... Like, you don't get kicked out, sure, but that's not a stream. No, but you missed the point. Because I still stream, right? My viewers and I still have a good time. The only difference is the manner in which people, when people are talking to me about a stream, usually by the, by the time they're talking to me about the stream, I'm almost done doing what it is I came to do. Yeah, right? but the phone is usually, also in, no, in your pocket is, no, the whole time. No, no, actually not in my pocket. It's just down, right? It's just down. It's just down. It's not up high. It's just right here. They still see me. I'm still at the mall. I'm just getting seeing the mall. Or I turn the camera facing people, but still, it's not in the air. Now, uh, what I'm trying to make you understand is that when you hold it in the air, there's nothing wrong with that. I actually like you because you do that. Like, you're proud of the job you're doing. There's nothing wrong with walking in with a, with a camera like that. And I understand people find it, you know, they're root there, they're, you know, they, they kick you out and things like that, but there's no reason to just cave in. Like, we're going to the car already. Don't follow me. Like, there's nothing wrong with this situation. You're kicking me out. I'm going. Don't I mean, raise the, your voice at me. Like, at, the end of the, at the end of the day, they do have the authority to do that. Ah, well, and if you also, argue with them, they're just going to call the police. And right, we don't guys. want that, obviously. Why would, I mean, we, why would we want that? It comes down to we're two different people. Like, when I see, I know real problems versus fake problems. Even and when it, I see a person with a fake problem trying to act like they have a real problem, it's quite pathetic. Right, but even if it's a fake problem, you don't win the situation by arguing with them. How do you win that? They were just going to call the police, well, and then they're, the, poli- out and the police are going to take their out. side. Like the other day we went to a store, I actually ended up shopping, you walked out. So you would have just gotten kicked out and kicked out and kicked out because you believe in holding it high, and as soon as they kick you out, walking out. I believe in holding it out high, doing what it is I came to do. And while they're trying to kick me out, I've been telling them what I'm here for. I'm here to shop. So yeah, you want me to walk out? Yeah, I'm going to buy the milk and walk out, which is what I came to do anyway. And while you're running your mouth because you're wasting more time telling me this story, because I'm here for five minutes, this milk buying is done in a few seconds. If you shut the fuck up, I'll be done buying milk and I'll be out the door. Now, if you want to continue calling the cops, please do it, because I guarantee you I'll be gone before they show up. Now, watch this. Keep doing what you're doing. Selfie stick up high. And see what we, <laughs> that's where the walk with me came from, right? Right. Because I did it in the store. <laughs> yeah, but right? I, you know, I, it's still, I mean, it's still it's, causes it's, it's problems. It's common sense, though, Paul. It's quite simple. Like, are you going to sit here? Chase me around then. Because I'll be done in two minutes. If it, you were just polite to me and say, okay, sir, hurry up or whatever the case may be, do it. Fine. I'll, I'll put it down or whatever the case may be. But don't come, come acting like you caught a thief. You didn't catch nobody. Like, you didn't. You're trying to not doing nothing here. You're wasting our time. I'm just a client. Sure, I I agree with you, (laughs) but it still causes problems. That's my point to you. If you see it as problems, don't do that, right? I do that because I know it's not a problem, and so I defend that. You see it as a problem, so don't do it because all it does is it puts. Well, I don't see it as a problem. I don't see it as a problem, but if somebody else sees it as a problem, I have to be considerate of what they're saying. If they think it's a problem, then sure, okay, it's, I, I could just go. If they have the authority in the situation and they think it's a problem, their authority outscales my consumer level. You do realize when we went to Miami, we went to like five different restaurants, selfie sticks up high, kicked out of each one of them, and we almost didn't eat that night. I think we ended up eating at a gas station. Do you remember that? Yeah. 
that's that personality, right? So you're extremely correct, right? You're you're understanding. You know what I mean? Because you're you're respecting their authority. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. I'm not telling you to not respect a person's authority. I'm saying if you're going to be right, but if, but if you ignore them and continue to buy your stuff, mm-hmm. it is, you know, not listening to their authority. Right. And it causes problems. If you choose to look at it that way, which is what I said in the beginning. How does it I not? hate when people see non-problems as, when they try to act towards non-issues as issues. This is guy like is so funny. Like, I am Diane. Where you do you find these bitch. people? LMFA. If you investigating your company, it would not be with a selfie stick up high. You should understand that already. Yeah, but at so the same I mean, at, at the same time, EBZ, you have to understand no, listen, that listen, listen, when listen, you're streaming, saying, you have to have let me finish, you have though. to hold the camera when you're streaming. Let me finish what I'm saying. You do. I took you back to when we were in Miami and we walked to like six, seven restaurants. Couldn't find a restaurant. We ended up eating. I think it was a gas. We ended up eating in some random ass place. But do you remember when we touched down? Was it Miami or Hawaii? When well, we got there, we went to the mall and it was restaurant after restaurant after restaurant. We were just kicked out of places. It was it was Hawaii. You remember that? Like as soon as we yeah. touched down in Hawaii, we were kicked out of like well, seven it's restaurants. Well, ve- it's very difficult to stream and you know go in the places that don't allow so, recording, obviously. So, so you have to bite the you bullet. Do otherwise, you either hold the stick down to conceal as much as you can until you get your food out the way. Turn the stream off to be private. Give them a ceiling stream so they can't see a, a damn thing. Or choose to hold the selfie stick up high and deal with what comes. The, but you can't keep caving in because you're wasting. You know, the, the better situation is you find a place that lets you stream the way you want to stream. You do realize and not have issues. In, the con- in the conversation of finding a place that lets you stream, you're t- either talking assistant or a good amount of minutes or hours spent researching, or somebody with you researching while we're con- well, while surely, we the surely that's not worse than pointing the stream at the camera for thirty or the ceiling for thirty minutes. Well, I gave you three circumstances that aren't normal: having an assistant, spending twenty minutes to research a place where you could stream while eating. Like, doesn't make any sense. <laughs> how many times do you even have, how much time do you have to put your address in the GPS and drive to the location? Much less researching which of those locations would let you stream. Like, come on, man, you're not making any sense. I give you three probabilities that are not even probable. So, in your, so what would you do? If, if I would do if exactly what I yourself. said. I would conceal the stream, complete my task, or uphold the stream and defend the stream and complete my task. Well, but I can't uphold the stream, and then every time I get interrupted during my task, bounce. Because now my task is just never completing, and I just keep doing the same dumb thing, which is, in my eyes, but the, upholding the, the, a, a camera, which gets me kicked out. Well, like, the, the, you pro- know that. the problem with both those things is the first option gives you gives the viewers a bad viewing experience, and the second option gives you problems. So the, the first better option, option is to viewers. find a place where you can just do what you want to do without any disturbance. How many times have you sat down and researched where you can I mean, usually I just use common sense. Bad example. example. EBZ has shown us many exotic ceilings we have never That's seen exactly before. That's example of what I'm talking about. So you've never done, done what you actually suggested. What do you mean? You've never done what you proposed. Yes, I've been kicked out of places no, before. No, no, no. What you did propose I was... I try to look for places what, that seems like they'd let us record. If you, we mind you, our own business. You said... You said... Find places that'll let you stream, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Then I asked you, how many times have you sat down to find places that'll let you stream? I mean, depending on the situation, I guess how a few. How often do you find yourself I mean, not, not often, because usually it's common sense where you can film and where you can't film. And when you say common sense, are you basing it on places you frequent... Or just these kind of environments, like everywhere. Well, because places I frequent, mo- I already know. That's well, basic. It, it's just experience. Most places that I've been to, like a mall, they don't let you could, re- don't could let you record. Yeah, we took their word for it. But most places I've been to that have malls, don't, malls don't let you record in there. There's but nowhere. We gave it a Paul, try. Paul, there's nowhere that lets you record. That's not true. I mean, give me an example. The zoo. How many times do you go to the zoo, my friend? Well, you said <laughs> I like no. that example. What do you mean? How many times do you go to the zoo? Come How many on, times do you go to that ghetto mall? Zoo, what do you mean? At the zoo, we weren't getting a reception in certain areas, so it's not like you were you were leave, you were trying to walk away from the monkey area because it, they had bad reception. So it's not what you're gonna do often. Like you did. It. When is the last time you went to the zoo, Paul? 
I went to a zoo in, my, in Hawaii. I was I mean, another zoo in California. What does that have to do? Back. What does that and have to do with anything? Now. I've been to the zoo three times in the past four or five months. But what does that, that have? What does that have to do with the conversation? My point is that you would not go to a zoo, so it's not one of those environments that we should even talk about. Okay, we went to the the barbecue the barbecue place. We recorded there just fine. The one I the one I came up with, right? Uh -huh. Yeah, but. So what's your that, argument? That's, that's that's like that's like yeah, they didn't see anything. You know what I mean, they weren't gonna say anything. Yeah, ABZ does not anything. have the mentality of putting his stream first. Right? He would so he rather go about his own business and not care about his viewers for content. No more than I do when it comes to the streaming thing. No one wants you with cameras in their facility. I just disagree with that statement. Okay. Why? Because the barbecue place, they didn't want to That's kick us out. That's a barbecue place you found out about five minutes ago. I'm talking about <laughs> your entire streaming career. Nine times out of ten, everywhere we go, we're kicked out. Yes? No? Yes. Bingo. I, I would so say. What are you talking about? <laughs> well, I would. I would say it's like half and You're half. You're trying to deny the obvious, Paul. I would say. I would say. I would say it's half. I would say it's half. I would say it's half and half. Getting kicked out is the norm, is what I'm trying to say. Like, it's not a problem getting not kicked really. out. Not really. I mean, to be fair, I go to plenty of places and not get this kicked out. This guy is funny, man. I didn't He's get trying kicked. to act like being Dude. kicked out is a rare I didn't get kicked out of a single place in Canada. Like, every so often we get kicked out. No, Paul. We always get kicked out of everywhere. I, if we, we don't I, get kicked out, then that's a good place. I went to Canada. I didn't get kicked out of anywhere recording. Well, maybe you have different experiences than I do, right? Uh, my experiences are based in California and a few... Of the certain of the certain places. types of places will kick you out. Other types of places won't, and you have to pick the right places. Well, at the end of the day, the going statement is getting kicked out when you're a streamer. That goes without saying. Not maybe when you get to a certain status in streaming, you can do certain things that put you in certain predicaments. So, from a viewer standpoint, that prevents you from being kicked on, out. But from a viewer standpoint, would you prefer for the streamer to find somewhere where he can record, or to get a ceiling stream? To get a what? A ceiling stream. Wait, slow down. Those are hmm. What are you talking about? That's like asking, do you want to be good or bad? Like, well, no that's shit, what, I want to be good. That's what it what is, though. That's what it comes down to. That's what it comes down to. What we're saying is, what we're saying is, would you rather the, the streamer risk getting kicked out or have a great stream with a limited view? Tell your Uber driver to shut his damn mouth. Uh, it depends. Those are two options. Pick one. <laughs> well, you it's not good or bad. Those, those are the. Uh, those are the. Depends, no, it, it the depends, that's the situation. It can, it can be, it can it's A, a and B. Would be you? We're talking about you walking into a scenario where if, A, if, if you gonna, cut the stream off. If I'm gonna walk let me just with, give you those options uh -huh, very simply. If I'm gonna walk out with more money in my pocket, all right, fuck it. I'll deal with it. You're talking about being the streamer. I'm talking about being the viewer. Yeah. He asked you a question as the viewer, right? He yeah. says viewer. Would you rather the streamer, and you made sense. You pretty much said what I'm saying. Why the fuck would I cut my, my stream off and make less money? Yeah. Uh, and why would, I, why would I risk getting kicked out and make less money? Why don't I just give a limited view yeah, and but, make more money? At least yeah. make as much as I can while I'm here. Yeah. Versus come in with my selfie stick of high, entertain the viewers for the first two seconds, and then, oops, security is here saying I'm done. Like, come on, yeah, that's making it, sense. It's not like, about. You're supposed to moderate ABC, yourself. It's, it's like giving it's, a, not, it's about the viewer experience, no, not it's money. Like, it's, like, it's like getting in a fight. It's like watching boxing. You don't come out there swinging just because the fans are going, oh my God, you got it. You don't do that. The, you pace your fucking self. Stream, like, the you're the, the boxer. Like you're the boxer. You're supposed to manage yourself, not just explode because they tell you to fucking give it all you got. And also that the, the <laughs> security at these places don't care about make you making money. Why would they care about that? Now, if you ask me, a, a, stream, a ceiling stream with no TCS or a stream where, the, where you can do your thing, I'd rather stream where you can do your thing because there's no TCS to keep on with the ceiling stream. No, because the ceiling stream only comes about because anything around us will divulge our location. You're in a restaurant which has the cups, the names, of the, you know what I mean? Yeah, like but the you have to understand the viewer experience. I don't think you understand that, EBZ. You can't just give the viewers a bad experience and expect... I think you're seeing it in a very shallow and, and, way. And well, I think you're seeing it in a very shallow I, way. I'm seeing it in a way that makes the stream not no, bad. No, you're seeing my perception in a very shallow way because when I talk about managing a bad situation... You're talking about being explosive in that bad situation. That is pathetic. And then you're spinning around, making it sound like I'm the one who is not containing the bad situation. Meanwhile, you're the one who is saying things that prevent us from containing 
a bad situation. I just talked about walking into a, a, a scenario in which they're gonna kick you out. You wanna make $100. You walk into this place, the first one minute, you're gonna get kicked out if they see your camera. You're not gonna make $100, you're gonna make a dollar. Versus walking into this place, concealing your camera, or giving them a limited view it, at, with your camera, enables you to make at least 50 or 60 while being here. But you can still make the same money without giving the viewers a pocket stream. If you it's just, not a pocket if you just stream. walk out, like what do you mean? A pocket like this would work. I don't, under, I don't understand. If you're this heated, let someone else drive. You can focus on the road. Who's heated? No, he's driving fine. Yeah. Don't worry about it. But yeah, he's fine. <laughs> it's like you could just leave and make the same money if that's if that's the value that you're going.